It's Monday. Hey guys, Monday, we're going camping. Again, again, I was not gonna vlog this, but Fox it. requested the vlog. And we're going camping. <laughs> we're going camping. Now here's the thing, before I sound like a snob, like a prissy little princess and ungrateful, hear me out. I have paid my dues when it comes to camping. Did you know I camped every single year growing up when I was your age? How many years? Every year, every year of my childhood life, if you've been following me for more than seven years, you'll know that I camped alone in my parents' car. Like, I slept in my parents' car so I could snowboard alone. If you know, you know. I've done it all. I've camped. I've pooped in the bush. I have gone without a shower for like a week. Like, I have done this. So when people say to me, just wait, wait till you camp, you'll love it. I told my dad when I was the ripe age of 12, I was not meant for this life. And I loved elements of camping, don't get me wrong. Like it was a really fun childhood and I have fond memories from it, but like it was never my favorite holiday. I will admit out of my family unit, I'm definitely the most princessy, but like I come from a camping family. I'm not really a princess, just compared to like my dad and my other sisters, right? So anyway, I vowed that the day that I could afford to go on beautiful, luxurious holidays Holidays, I would never camp again. Then I had boys. <laughs> Honestly, I don't think it's a boy thing necessarily. I think it's just like a kid thing. Fox has been begging us to go camping with his best friend, Oxley. So Fox is five, Oxley is four, and we're really close with the parents of Oxley. So originally the dads, Kurt and Blake, Blake is the father of Oxley. They were just gonna go and take the boys. And then me and Amber, Amber is the mother of Oxley. We kind of got a bit of FOMO, foolishly. Despite growing up camping, I've never been the parent of a camping family, okay? Okay, or I've just like had to pack for myself. Packing for a family, we're camping for two nights, sleeping in a tent for two nights. We have been packing, and I say we, very, very light. Actually, let's see Kurt's reaction oh, yeah. to it. Kurt, we have been packing for like 48 hours. A little, little, little bit of time, not too long. I really thought you were gonna be like, we? I've done all the packing. Sarah's verdict on going camping is like, so basically you pack your life up into your car, you drive somewhere random, and then you go like you unpack it house. to act like you have a house. It's stupid, we're playing. Be one with nature, darling. My thing is, I get it. I get the fun of camping, like be one with nature, la la la. But like with toddlers, I'm like, life is already hard. Like what? We've been packing for honestly 24 hours, maybe over. I don't want to come across ungrateful. And I know I'm doing that right now, but I, I just don't, un I would just do not understand. I do not understand the draw to camp. Anyway, it's for the kids, okay? My dad has literally messaged me being like, be a good vibe. It's about the boys. Suck it up. You'll have a good time. And like I said, I cooked all day yesterday. Like I had to cook our dinner tonight, prep the breakfast stuff, cut up all the fruit because like toddlers, they just eat. They just eat all day. I need to change my attitude because I'm going in negative. Let's say some affirmations. I, Sarah Tills, promise to be a good vibe. Only positive words will come out of my mouth. Hallelujah. Amen. Hi, God. <laughs> Is this really worth it? Can you stop being negative Nancy <laughs> over there? Far out. For two days. And we're not, well, are we glamp? We're not glamping. I mean, no. We are, we bringing, are, bringing, we are bringing our coffee machine though. <laughs> Louis ready for a nap. I'm leaving the house a bomb. For everyone who says my house is always clean, no it's not. Okay, you wanna put your Crocs on? Yeah. Okay, so you wanna go camping with your brother? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Say camping. Tell me. Am I going camping? Tell me. <laughs> How are we feeling? Great, Abby's coming with us. Oh, uh, now she's gonna go on a little holiday as well. What? She's going to Declan's house. Come on, Abby. Oh my oh. God. Abby, where'd you go? She's at the door. She's inside. Oh my God. She's inside already. She loves it. Hey, man. Hello. How are you? Fox wants to come in and pat some of the dogs. Can you do that? Come on in. Hi, guys. <laughs> Hello. Abby, she's pumped up. They're all out here. Wow. Look at all the Some puppies. big ones in there. Oh, you excited, bud? Yeah. This year, we have ticked off some serious dad goals. Like, yeah, true. We're done. We're doing camping. Fox has learned to surf. Malachi has surfed with his father. My wife now surfs behind the boat. We go out on the boat as a family and the whole family enjoys it. So, so what you're saying is your tank is full. Your cup is full. So full. I need to go on a little girly retreat. No, because your girly retreats are expensive. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to go by myself. I'm going to go and do Pilates. I'm going to do a face mask. I have one more goal. Oh, what? To go snowboarding in Japan. Okay, 
all right well let's just finish let's finish making our tribe let's finish making our family yeah. then once all the little groms are created and then once we've done that oh, Japan one, we get <laughs> We get Actually, motorbikes. Shut, oh my box. gosh. Yeah. Motorbikes. This is why I need a daughter. This is why I need or, or, or one of the boys to be like, let's go get facials, mum. Let's do that. I feel like Malachi might be my facial guy. Actually, Fox, you love a facial moment. Do you want yeah. to go get facials with me? No, they're boring. Okay. They're boring <laughs> At least my dog's a girl. Please. You can get a cat. No. <laughs> In the thick of the Australian bush. Right here. Home sweet home. It smells like camping here, doesn't it? Smells like a whale's vagina. <laughs> <laughs> smells like mouse poops. Yeah. Are you kidding? Whoa. How's the serenity? Oxley! This is my best friend Oxley. Oxley, say hi. Whoa, go Mooey. Watch, watch out, Mooey. <laughs> Mooey! <laughs> okay, so apparently the men, Kurt and Blake, are deciding where we're gonna set up camp. Watch this! Are you doing a push? Yes! Yes! Oxley, you should be my son! What is happening? I have an idea. You be my son and Fox is Amber's. I like my son! <laughs> what happened? Oh, okay, something's happening. Something's being erected to us. Morning. The great erection is happening. <laughs> <laughs> Morning of erections. I'm gonna need your help with this one. This me? Is a, me? Yeah, this is a real. You told me I didn't have to help. Just one thing. What? Can you reach that? What? <laughs> I'm not having fun. <laughs> Why are you not going in your hole? The erection's wrong. <laughs> I thought you guys promised us that if we went camping, you would all help. How's this helping going? It's going bad. <laughs> you say you want to rough it and go camping. We've got the real Quinnies over here with a real tent. Kurt, what kind of tent did you get? Tell us. Yeah, what are you talking about? All right, okay. I bought an inflatable tent. <laughs> I wanted. To, I see Blake doing this whole setup, and I'm like, I've got to do something. We'll be back in 45 minutes, and Fox is going to be jacked. <laughs> yeah, he's going to be so jacked. The tent of my dreams, Kurt. Oh my gosh. No, Wake up, oh, coffee. Okay, the grand tour. This was really hard to set up. <laughs> <laughs> I did not do a single thing. My I'm gonna gosh, edit that. I'm like hopping But look, look at this beautiful outlook. The boys are out there surfing at the moment. You can see what the intro area here. We've got the living room, the living quarters with the most important addition of the trip. Mummy and Daddy's bed, mini human. I mean, we should have went beds. for a double bed on ours just to give a little bit more space. But you know what? Stuff the kids. Or do we have a queen? Good teamwork. <laughs> I hate you so much right now. Like you don't even understand. I did I absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. <laughs> Malachi is making best friends with a cockatoo. Named him Alfie. Alfie. It's gonna fight. you don't fight cockatoo. Look at that fighting stance. <laughs> Party going on here. Wait, come over here. Oh my gosh, there's bluey everywhere. Hold him. Cuddle? Yeah, cuddle. Cuddle? Why not? Why not, brothers? What an afternoon. Campsite is all set up. Look at this setup we got going here. We've got tents, cars, we've got boards, we've got bikes, we've got kids with torches on their heads. Malachi, give us a look. Whoa, nice, man. <laughs> Oh my gosh, you're yeah. scaring me, Mui. You're scaring me. Yeah, like that. Oh, hey! represent. Yeah, the girls. I paid her to do that. <laughs> How's camping going so far? For you? Um, okay, pros. I have done absolutely nothing. You haven't done a single thing. I have not lifted a finger. I feel like a princess. I feel like the princess I want to be. Negatives. The bathroom's far away. I'm going to have poo anxiety if you know. Who you know. There we go. <laughs> This sass. Good yeah, location. Did you pick this? And the good old place. Good. Blake did. Good yeah, Blake. Blake. The boys, the boys, yeah, Blake. The boys. I'm excited to play games with the parents later. That yeah. sounded really weird. Like board games. Chameleon. Chameleon's my new favorite game, and that's what I want to play with everyone. If you don't know Chameleon, look it up. It's really fun. This is what we're having for dinner. I prepped this at home. Because I was a camper, I know how much I hate washing up camping. So I tried to do as much at home as I could. So I made a pasta salad, which is going to accompany our meat, which is going to be cooked on the floor. Yeah, Blake, this is something we need to sort out, mate. We should. We need another table. It's good for you. Go for it. 
<laughs> have a good squat there, man. How's your first camping dinner? Good. Is it good? Good. How you doing? Yeah, good. Hi guys, our sleep was great. Oh, hi guys. Um. <laughs> Hi, it's me again. Oh, you have your phone. What's the time? 6.17. 6.17. Not as bad as I thought. Malachi woke up in the middle of the night for some reason. Oh, and Zayla so woke up nice. early in the morning. <laughs> so we've just had babies crying, really. Tell you what, I am tired. Very, very tired. These two, dead set, kept us up all night last night. I'm busting to pee and the bathroom's like 500 meters away. <laughs> no, no. If my dad was here, he'd say, stop being such a princess. Stop being such a bad mood. You know what? My sleep was actually not as bad as I thought I would have. I'm a really bad sleeper. Yeah, I basically just struggle to sleep anywhere that's not my bed. If the little ones hadn't cried in the night and the morning, I would have had a good sleep. Like that was super, super comfortable. I was really warm. I really love sleeping with the whole family in one room. I'm like the most calm when I sleep next to my kids. I expected to be a lot more tired this morning. One of my favorite things to do in the morning, if I'm like feeling a bit gross, is put these eye patches on. I think let's bring out a pack for Amber. Oh, look at you guys. Hello. Little camping boys. How was your night? Good. Yeah, did you have good sleep? Foxy, you look a little bit weathered. <laughs> Fun. Amber, are you so excited to do this again? Can't wait. <laughs> All right, big gal's time to shine. My time to shine in the coffee department. Absolutely no regrets about bringing this thing. First sip of the camping coffee. What are you doing? What are you are you enjoying camping yet, Seth? I can just feel all the comments being like, she's such a snob, like, she's so unappreciative. This is lovely. Are you supposed to pan? This oh. is lovely. But like, what do you do? You do this. You're doing it. You eat pizza shop. I'm doing it. This is camping. This is camping? You got the ducks behind you. You got your, your Kindle. Your kids are quiet, doing something. So this is the best the weather's going to get. It's like pleasant. But apparently, we're about to get gale force winds and rain. How are you feeling? Really good, my kid just almost got concussed. <laughs> <laughs> so massive turn of events. It is raining now and the wind at the moment is fine, but the gusts, like the gusts of winds are scary. <laughs> Fox, tell us what's happening. I'm getting him changed right now to leave. What just happened? We were camping and then storm just come. Oxley was having a nap in his tent and the wind is so crazy that their whole tent collapsed on top of Oxley and the forecast is just supposed to be torrential. Like crazy winds, crazy rain. So we're calling it, we're packing up at the moment. I feel so bad. Like the boys literally packed, set this up like less than 24 hours ago, but it's gonna get bad. So here's the plan. We're gonna get changed to go. We'll go to Oxley's house for a play. How are you feeling? I'm annoyed. Yeah. That took me like three hours to set everything up yesterday. Okay, so the plan is we've got all the kids in this car. Mummies are driving them home. Daddies are staying home to pack up this whole thing. Boys, how are you feeling? Good. Good. <laughs> Honestly, how are you feeling, bud? But at least we get to go home to the Quinn's house. We're going to have a play at my house. Woohoo! I feel so bad for the husbands. Look at that. Oh, Love oh, you guys. Oh, Bye. Okay. Have fun. Yeah. You, you wait, they'll stay. <laughs> See you tomorrow. <laughs> They'll be like, oh, the wind actually oh. went down, so we're just gonna stay for a surf trip. Up. It'll be a boy <laughs> surf trip. <laughs> you actually blend into it. This was their plan all along yeah, to get rid of us with all of the kids. <laughs> wow, that gust. Can you hear that? It's luscious. I'm back in my element. The indoor, no, no. My element is not the indoors. I love being outdoors. I just don't like 
camping. <laughs> it's been a week. Hi, I just had to replenish some things from the health food store. So I figured I'll show you what I got and we can debrief. And look, I don't want to be a broken record and I don't know if I'm like digging myself a hole by justifying this, but here's my thing. I don't want to come across like a princess. As I said, I grew up camping. I understand what people would like about it, but it's, it's just not for me. And I felt so bad when we had to pack up and leave. Fox, distraught is not even the word that explains his emotions and his face when I told him we had to pack up and leave. Like he was crushed, crushed. I felt so bad for him. But then I was like, let's go, like this, let's go. It didn't help that we couldn't have a fire. Like sitting by the fire, spaghetti, is such a beautiful part of camping. And like for me, the best part of camping, hemp seeds. Oh my gosh, do you guys remember when I was obsessed? Only the OG OGs. Like, I didn't even know Kurt when I was obsessed with these. I was living at my parents' house in that tiny Harry Potter room, I used to call it. I had the tiniest room of the house. Yum. Yum! I just saw them in the health food store and I was like, I could snack on these for sure. Yum! So, foolishly, I thought that I had gotten out of this camping promise, commitment, scot-free. Apparently, according to both of our husbands, it didn't count and we have to go again. It's fine. Honestly, I'm a selfless mother. I'm a selfless wife. I'll put on my fake a smile. It's just not my idea of a holiday. Oh my gosh, my favorite new tea. Lavender, peppermint, chamomile. Elite. I'm gonna make my Mediterranean also buco. It's a free recipe on my website, linked below. Yeah, so many mums in my Instagram DMs like validated my feelings. I think it's like as parents, but like specifically mothers, we do so much. Like I am constantly doing laundry, cleaning up the boys' stuff, picking up Nerf guns. Just like I'm always cleaning, always organizing, always doing housework. So then to go on a holiday and go camping, it's extra work. Everything is like just that extra effort. Then you come home and everything's dirty. And then you just are drowning in laundry. Do you know what I mean? Do you know what I mean? I'm just validating why it's not my vibe. Malachi hates mint toothpaste, so he gets strawberry. Some lollies, my favorite kitchen spray. And that's it, that's all I got, just a little haul. But I just wanted to finish this vlog by saying I'm not ungrateful. I want my kids to have a good time. I want them to have the best childhood and go camping. Cause apparently, according to my husband, you can't have a good childhood unless you go camping. So I'm here for it. But if you see us on a holiday other than camping, it was organized by yours truly, okay? So I'm planning the next family holiday and it won't involve a tent. Hope you enjoyed this vlog. I'll see you in the next one. Hopefully I'm a better vibe. <laughs>